this is a problem that has been in Ohio's face for quite some time now. The Ohio House Bill 6 controversy. It's been called the largest bribery scandal in Ohio politics. Now that was signed into law in 2019. In 2019, you were actually on the Senate Public Utilities Committee. You voted yes back then on House Bill 6. A lot of people voted yes back then on House Bill 6. Then we come to find out former Ohio House Speaker Larry Householder now convicted of federal crimes. Now we know that Sam Randazzo has been indicted as well. And parts of Ohio House Bill 6 are still on the books. Where do you stand on Governor Mike DeWine's now call, which was a change, he didn't call for it at first, but for the full repeal of Ohio House Bill 6 and taking back those subsidies for coal plants? Okay, well, well first let's, let's not make some assumptions here. Mm -hmm. the, the bill that the Senate passed is very, very different than the bill that the, the House, where all this corruption occurred, came from. So. The, the House Bill 6 under the Senate changed. One of the reasons it changed under me is we had, we had renewable standards in our law. The Ohio House took them completely out, back to zero. They were at 12%, so I negotiated 8%. So we got renewable standards back in because I believe in an all of the above energy plan for Ohio. I mean, oil and gas is, our, is really our baseline and it's gonna provide our baseline energy, but I didn't want to shut down innovation technology. So when we say, um, you know, we should just get rid of it, we'll make sure we know what we're talking about in terms of making all of the above energy choices. Yeah, if we can get rid of the OVEC, but understand this, again, what, what that bill did is three utility companies in Ohio have been getting subsidized for those two for years. What the bill did is provide a fourth utility company to also get their subsidy for that. So it is unfair to simply say that this created the subsidy, it just added a fourth utility to get the subsidy. But at the end of the day, to suggest in any way that Larry Household's behavior led over to anyone in the Senate, anyone on the Senate Energy Committee, or our decision on that bill uh, is completely false. So to be clear, you would support the repeal of the coal plant subsidies, is that I correct? Would, yeah, yeah. Okay.